Hello, welcome to the non-PCB Smart Spin 2K build guide. Your first step is going to be the visit the GitHub and check out the Instructable, followed by printing all of your parts and acquiring all the electronics. This is an old case design. The new cases do not require modification that I do with the Dremel later in the video. You can see the first parts I assemble here are the wire harness for the shifter cable, as well as the wire harness for the power cable. This is the older, again, non-PCB SmartSpin 2K case. Those get inserted into the holes on the case. Next, I install the gear onto the stepper motor, maybe don't use a hammer, and then the stepper crossbar with the M6 Allen screws. Next, let's build the shifters. Use a knife to clean out the shifter housing for where the buttons go. Then take your stereo mini cable and cut the RCA ends off. Separate the wiring and solder on a diagonal across the shifter buttons. Then put a bunch of hot glue on the back of the shifter, put the back cover on, and depress the button a number of times so, until you get the best button action. Next I use a Dremel to modify the case so that the larger knob cup drive gear will fit. Press the bearings into the case, put a washer uh, over the drive shaft, as you can see here, then press the knob cup onto the drive shaft. Here we begin to wire the electronics together. I soldered the LM2596 directly to the power leads, and then used a small flathead screwdriver to adjust the voltage to show 5 volts. The next thing I do is power the TMC2225 with that 5 volt output. Don't have a good set of crimping tools, I just cut and splice the wire harness for the pancake motor. Make all the connections following the wiring diagram on the GitHub. You can see I'm going to add a resistor in line for the UART connection. Install the heat sink on the TMC2225. Make sure to flash the ESP32 software at this point from the GitHub. Here I am using Zwift to confirm that the knob cup is going to rotate in the correct direction for uphill and downhills. If not, you can just flip-flop the connection on the TMC2225. For final assembly, everything gets installed into the case. There's the stepper motor being installed with the Phillips head screws on the stepper crossbar. Then we'll use some machine screws on the opposite side of the case to secure the stepper motor. Followed by organizing all the wiring and getting it placed into the case. Again, since I did not have uh, appropriate connection tools, my wires are a little bit too long here, but for the demonstration purposes, you can see that there is room for everything. It does all fit and the case will screw down. Next up, Power it on again, plug in your shifter cables, and make sure the knob cup is moving correctly. Congratulations, you've just put together the SmartSpin 2K.